Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology Channel, and um, I will say it again. When Microsoft updates its images, its uh, downloads for the uh, Windows 11 25H2 on its website, uh, yes, you can use the tools if you want to upgrade to Windows 11 25H2 on unsupported machines. Yes, it will update. I don't know how many people said it won't update, it won't update. I've already won't update. It updates. Okay, it works. It that's it, and nothing more. Uh, it is on my uh, the the insider um, build is on my old eight year old machine, and everything is fine. So yes, you can move on to Windows 11 25 H2 on unsupported hardware. Continue getting all the security updates every month and the bug fixing updates. The problem will arise only in two years uh, if we get to something called 27H2 or I don't know, where, uh, yeah, when we change version, that's where the problem is. You have to use the tool again because it doesn't upgrade from the build. But for the rest, if you do install a unsupported uh, version of Windows 11 25H2 on a machine, and it works fine, you're okay to go. So yes, that's a alternative for a lot of Windows 10 users that would like to do so. It will, you know, give you the possibility of running Windows 11 and you'll be running Windows 11 for a couple of years and continue using your machine, even if it's unsupported. So, uh, yep, it is working and will continue working. I don't think Microsoft will ever change that loophole for a very simple reason. Um, it puts more users into Windows 11 and maybe gives you the idea that, oh, well, maybe I should buy a new machine and get Windows 11 finally, uh, depending on who you are. But, uh, yep, it works. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.